and still in education let's get our education segment Education is the key to success, as the wise men said. But success comes from hardworking and passion. In Msakasa Technical Training Institute, located in Bumula Subcounty in Bungoma County, is the center for excellence in equipping the trainees with skills and knowledge in technical studies. Msakasa um, started in uh, 2013 as an initiative of the former MP, uh, Mr. Mweshimiwa Wakoli before him. Uh, he wanted the people around here to also benefit from the government's plan to venture into Tibet. Uh, so he instituted plans uh, using CDF at that time to acquire this place and set up the institution. At the time they started, there was a course in uh, fashion design and uh, right now as we speak we have seven departments running a total of around 40 courses. We have courses in the uh, Department of ICT, Department of Business Studies. We have a Dean's Office that is concerned with uh, students' welfare. But matters to do with training, all the way from marketing of the institution to admissions, to actually the running of classes, production of courses, all the way to the examinations, the list of exams are all coordinated in the office of the registrar. According to the deputy principal in charge of academics, the facility has full set of equipment in mechatronic engineering department, thus being the center for excellence in western region. Uh, a great achievement is that we are a center of uh, mechatronic engineering and in mechatronics we are doing the CDAC exams. Our students have already begun the level 5 and 6. They have started the first series of CDAC exams and we are expecting them to do the second series. And uh, from the results that were achieved, actually the results were good. We are a center of excellence in mechatronic engineering and uh, we have all the machineries that go hand in hand with this uh, area. Actually, we are proud because in this region, we are uh, actually the center of interest in that particular area. And uh, we have a number of students who are sitting for those courses at all levels. Apart from mechatronic engineering, the institute offers diploma, certificate and artisan courses in ICT, fashion and design, hospitality, building and construction, carpentry, automotive engineering, among many other courses. We have electrical and electronics engineering department. In that department, we have electrical engineering, we have electrical installation. We have building and uh, civil engineering department, where we have a number of courses. We have building technology, we have civil engineering, we have land survey, quantity survey, plumbing, carpentry and joinery and masonry. Those are the courses that we have at all levels, diploma certificate and artisan. Agriculture and environmental studies department. Now in this department we do general agriculture and uh, we even have plans of studying water technology, agriculture value addition and horticulture. We are also doing agricultural engineering. We have a department of hospitality and institutional management. So we have the hospitality area where we do catering and accommodation. We have foods and beverages, we have clothing and textile, we also have fashion and design. Uh, other than that, we have a business studies department. In this department, we have a number of courses. We have finance, we have accounting, we have supply chain management, we have secretarial, we have human resource management, we have business administration, we do marketing, and we also have plans to start cooperative management and project management in the near future. Uh, our program, uh, we are projecting to start social work and community development in the near future. Now, we also have a special, uh, special needs department where we also have uh, students in special needs. It is not a studying department, but we incorporate the students in other departments, though we look at them individually in terms of their needs. In partnership with other institutions, the facility ensures that their trainees acquire practical skills in the areas of studies from the industries related to their courses. As a college, 
because of the meager resources that we have, we decided to now come up with partnership with the industry so that we can uh, make use of the uh, materials and infrastructure in the industry to assist our students in practicals. For instance, we are uh, partnering with Toyota Kenya and Isuzu in Bungoma so that our students are exposed, especially the automotive students. Now, we have also come up with uh, a partnership between Shamberere, which is ongoing, and our college, because Shamberere is a center of, of uh, excellence in mechanical engineering. So our students, we are partnering between the students and the trainers uh, so that we can ensure that our students in mechanical engineering and mechatronics achieve the best and also in electrical. Now, hospitality and institutional management, that is an area that we are also still having mega resources. We are working on it to ensure that uh, we partner with the Zuri Resort for the practicals for our students, particularly in catering, accommodation and housekeeping. We are a team, we are working together and uh, this is um, a place that is growing. The attitudes and uh, expectations are very high um, and we are looking forward to progressing. Um, we, we take care of all, uh, we, we serve the whole country. I also help the trainers develop their quality objectives for the institution, help the management where they need to uh, do their work so that we offer quality standards to our students. On other hand, the institute has requested the stakeholders in the education sector to assist in solving the water crisis in school as the students travel long distance in searching of the life-saving commodity among other essential services like security. As a college, we have a greater challenge in terms of water. Uh, we lack water in the institution and therefore our students spend most of the time looking for water, especially risking their lives in the evenings where they have to go line up to look for water until very late in the night, which we think it is uh, of a concern. In terms of security, we have a problem with security. So water and security go hand in hand. We also look forward that uh, maybe a donor or the government or a well-wisher may see it or deem it uh, important to bring maybe on board the issue of how best can we drill water in the college because the resources appear to be minimal. Security, because the college lacks hostels within, our students stay within the environment. So we are also thinking that in the near future, if we could be able to get security lighting around, it would be good for our students, especially when they are doing their night remedials. Due to the quality of knowledge and skills offered from the facility, the management has called on the youths in the region to join Musakasa Technical Training Institute. Majority of our trainers are in their prime, and majority of them are in the industry. So when you get a trainer in electrical, this is someone who is in the industry working. If you get a trainer in building, this is someone who is building out there. Uh, they are giving our students first-hand experience in what is expected of them when they leave the institution. Mine is to encourage those students maybe who are out there, they haven't gotten their, their opportunities to train, to come to Msakasa. We offer a range of courses beginning from electrical engineering, building and construction engineering. For my education segment, Maisha Television, I'm Millicent Makoha.